Hi little artists, today we are making a Ramadan banner. The banner that I show you today says Ramadan Kareem and it has some other fun symbols like the moon and lanterns and stars. These pieces of paper, the squares, the rectangles that you make, they don't have to be put together as a banner. You could instead use these as note cards, thank you cards, or cards to give away for Ramadan. For today's art project, I'm using oil pastels, crayons, watercolor paint, and white paper, a thicker paper that I have cut into small rectangles. Hey, Mr. Brush. Let's get started. I'm going to be using either an oil pastel or a crayon. They both do the same thing for this project. We are going to be making a resist. You should be familiar with this technique. I'm going to be drawing a crescent moon. You can see that I'm using white oil pastel, so it's kind of hard to see. But if you look closely, you can see what I'm drawing. Hmm, I think I'll add a star over here as well. The moon is a symbol, a very important symbol in Islam. Um, if you celebrate Ramadan, the moon, lantern, the different symbols that you see today in the video, you can choose to draw those. If you don't celebrate Ramadan, this is your art project, so you can choose the kind of symbols and things that you want to draw. Now comes the magic part. I'm using dark blue paint and I'm painting slowly over my white oil pastel. And as you can see, it resists, it pushes off the paint to reveal this beautiful moon. I think I'm gonna leave some white space around the edges of this paper. I kind of like how the watercolor paint looks, but if you want to paint the whole piece of paper, you can, that, that would probably look nice too. Ooh, I really love this midnight blue. Why don't we add some purple to it and see what that looks like. One reason why I love watercolor paint is that you can mix the colors and they blend really nicely together. So you can have fun and experiment. Beautiful. I find it very satisfying to paint over the white oil pastel and it doesn't mess up. It just pushes it away. I love how those colors mix. This is still really wet, so I'll put it over by the window to dry. Now we can draw some more images for Ramadan. I'm drawing lanterns. Lanterns are a symbol of light. I'm using oil pastels and crayons and different colored paints with some patterns for my ideas. Remember, this is your banner, so you can decide what you want to include on it. The next part that I'm gonna do is I'm starting to write the, the letters that spell Ramadan Kareem. I wrote my sign in English because English is my first language. If you want to write your sign in a different language, that would be awesome. And once you're all done, painting, letting them dry completely. You can start to piece them together. At the end of the video, you can see I put mine on a piece of string that I hung up on the wall and I had these little clips and I just clipped the signs, clipped the letters to the string. And don't forget, if you don't wanna make a banner like this, you can give away the little cards as note cards. For example, I have a neighbor that I wanna say Ramadan Kareem to, so I will write on the back Ramadan Kareem and, and write them a little note on the back and then just give them one card. I can't wait to see what you make. Remember, take your time, try your best, and have fun.